Ah. Get my rager on. Get my rave on. Uh, 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 uh. Ice cream scoop, ice cream scoop, ice cream scoop, ice cream scoop. Lawn no. mower, lawn mower, yeah? So, yeah, this is interesting. Do you ever do the shopping cart? All the time did I ever do the shopping. I invented the shopping cart. No, Stephanie. you didn't, because I was doing that sucker in middle school. Here, let's do the shopping Why cart. Bad. Okay, ready? Just to prep for next time. Ready? ready? Do, 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 do. Do, 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 up, down, and down, and high, and high. Ice cream! Hello, Internet. Welcome to Game. Hey, guys, and welcome to GT Live, where today I am a sneezy poop. <laughs> I am. I am sneezing nonstop today, and it is, it is uncomfortable. Is it strange? Do you feel that right now your life is strange. No, I feel it's actually fairly mundane, really. I'm just kind of stuffed and allergenic. Well, that makes a terrible segue for this game. Thanks. Thanks. You're welcome. So let's do this. Let's do it. Let's see Go what happened it. to our friend, Chloe. Continue. The story let's do it. continues. On life is Previously on Life is Strange. Starting way at the beginning. Max sleeps in class. Right? She wakes up. Who you're messing around with. Teenage violence. Touch me again, freak. Ball kick. Save Chloe number one. So, yeah. Our save Chloe count is getting higher and higher. Hanging out in a bus. Let's talk about your superpower. Oh. Save what Kate number one. Here, stop. Don't come near me. Not Time me. stop. It won't work. I know this It actually doesn't matter whether or not we say, like, Ms. the highlight of that moment Please was more of that she couldn't use everything. her power rather than, that's weird, yeah. that it's not like, hey, you saved her. That's Rachel's bracelet. Why the Save Chloe number two. Calm yourself. And three. Chloe's involved with, and four, actually. That was, that was her getting hit by a train, shooting herself, and getting shanked by the guy. Yep. Let's find what we want and beat it. Max? Breaking it under Teenage delinquency. There we go. Over and over. Stealing school That's records. Cool. I hope they flash back to us spilling the beans last time. Yes. Awful. Yes. Frank and beans. Frank and beans. Being more than a friend. Frank and Rachel. Being Frank. A little love Rachel's affair going on. To my it's a little soap opera we got going on. Chloe feels betrayed. She's probably gonna go my do something stupid dad, like kill herself for the fifth Hello? time. No, you don't. Mature stream, by the way, guys. Yeah, mature stream. Mature stream. They hella like dropped the F word a bunch. Yeah. Home when you're a kid. Also, you dank died, bug usage. In shit. Chloe, they I they do get their awesome. chemical on quite we a bit. Are awesome. <laughs> okay. We go back in time. Hello, are you even? So now we're the popular girl. Or yeah. Something. And all the whales are dying. Whales are going extinct. Because the world is ending. Max, Global Chloe. warming is a thing. Hold on. I think that Chloe, has more to do with our time you travel. Have a visitor. Every time we like travel through time, birds and whales just die. And this is wait, this is where we left off. Okay. We meet Chloe for the first time. For the first time in forever. For the first time in forever. See, this is this is a game about choice. Choose wisely. Is that how that song goes? Oh, it is. That song goes. That song goes like that. Something like that. I don't know. Yeah. Excuse me, I'm, I'm preparing for the... What are you grab? You need to grab me. Is it a crab? Grab me, Patty. What else would it be? Cockroach? Wait. Oh, I guess it could be a bird. It's not a bird. No, it is a crab. It's moving sideways. It's, it's scuttling. It it's scuttling. We're setting the mood right now. Square, Square Enix. Enix made this game? What? Square Enix presents... Sunset at the beach. I prefer long walks on the beach. Mmm. Mmm. Beautiful. Do you feel moved already? I, I am moved. I'm sobbing inside. Is that dead whale Does it really create the ambiance for you? <laughs> Nothing says romance like a dead whale on a beach. <laughs> That's what I always say. That whale carcass makes me want to hold hands. Wow, it's a lot of dead Jeez, wheels. wow. Oh my gosh. The makeup industry will be super stoked. What? Isn't that like always the thing that people say is like, oh, makeup is made out of whales and 
dolphins or whatever, right? Whale blubber. Yeah, right? right? Whale blubber. Thank you. Thank you, Jason. Still? Bye. No. Well, not still, but... I mean, Jeez. The old ways were the best ways. Right? Like Gris? Or is that what it's called? I believe so, yes. Get out of here. Wait, we're going to be talking. Get out of town. Dialogue shall be happening here in a second. Okay. We're so sorry. Gosh, why would why would you walk around here? Why would this be the the place where you would like take a stroll? Eh, you know. Hey friend, hey best friend, wanna it's go catch up around weird. the whale carcasses? Hanging out with you again. Okay. I know. I'm glad we are though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. But I love writing on it like an English poet. We're so deep. You deserve the best stationery. Some papyrus stationery. Top quality. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much. Yeah. So is Max just pretending the like worst thing you can she knows what happened? Like a baby. I... I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. Except for those dead what whales. <sighs> the golden hour. <gasps> the golden hour. With dead whales. Without you here, I'd have no clue. Bet you could take some amazing shots. Just those crop out the, so the dead sea life. Kind of You're like, oh yeah, my bad. I traveled back in time. You know how it goes. I'm alive here with you. So You're a real survivor. Chloe. We have to find out what happened here. I know you have to deal with. Max is so playing along like she I knows all. I mean, feeling sorry right? For you. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Don't blame William. No, don't blame William. Let's talk Why? About yeah. Are you okay to talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you Probably remember Nathan everything? Prescott, right? I saw prick. everything prick in bullet time. I saw everything in bullet time. And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. Oof. Oh. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. Jesus. I, I don't know what to say. Don't say anything. I'm just happy I did get to see you again. I could have ended up vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. Rachel? Rachel, still gone? God. No matter how much the butterfly effect affects things. I know. You would think, though, it would affect whether or not she disappears, right? Because, because, because Chloe, Rachel Chloe Amber, had a really close relationship with her. That's exactly why, because Rachel Amber and Chloe had a really close relationship. So if they don't have a close relationship because Chloe has, you know, this accident happen to her, that should have a fairly strong impact think, on Rachel Amber. I think Rachel was already kind of going down the road. It sounded like she was already involved in some weird stuff, whether or not she was hanging out with Chloe or not. Jason has something to say. We also don't know why Rachel is missing. So it could sure. be something else in her life. All right, well, let's, let's find out. All right, let's, let's, let's ask about Rachel. You mean Rachel? You mean Rachel Amber? When was the last time you talked to her? Uh, never. I just read about her in the news. I didn't even know her name. You did? This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? After that snow and eclipse, it's more like the end of the world. So they're still having the snow and the eclipse, though. That's also strange. Okay. Um. It... You think? Yeah, let's go, you Do think. Yeah. So? I haven't kept up with the details. I have more time on my hands than you. Plus, I'm a science nerd. Yeah? I mean, this makes yeah, sense. Chloe the science I nerd. seem out of control, but as long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe, I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. I, I was, was wrong. I was traveling through time. You're my best friend. I was in a weird Next. limbo state. 
thanks for coming out to see me. You're, you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my, my nose is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to my place? It is hella cold out here. Hella cold? Hella? hella. I hate that word, no offense. So, <gasps> this is a Chloe I can relate to! Yes! So, oh, Matthew! Sci what? Science nerd who is not fond of the word hella? I do appreciate that she's a science nerd. That's cool. Speaking my language. She does seem kind of sad, though. I mean, it was a pretty horrible accident. Sure. Okay, th it's interesting. I'm not saying that good things can't come out of bad situations. That happens all the time. I'm just saying, she seems kind of sad. Uh, and she seems kind of angry in the original timeline. And sad. Agreed. Agreed. So, like... She's just more like here. She has, she's, has an even tone about her, certainly. But the other one, she's also sad, but also angry, and just louder about it, and more destructive. She is. She is more destructive. It's a pretty high tech lair. Feels like a high tech cell. But I am lucky. My parents bust the house. Ooh, that's take interesting. Care of me. I know it's hard for them. They're grateful you are here with them. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, I know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive. But when you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Still get my rage Especially on. Especially when a nurse has to watch me. Especially when I'm playing games like the so Impossible Quiz. Or when doctors flip me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. Thanks again for coming, Max. I, uh, <clears throat> need to get my drink on. Uh, can you, can you bring me some water? I can do that. Yes, yes, we can, we can do that Ooh, thing. Snow globes. Snow globes are taking over. Attack of the snow globes! No, it's symbolic of the snow that happened. Oh, the snow dough. I guess snow not dough. everything changed. Right? It's a nice rhyme. Hello, Chloe. She likes fluffy animals now. Uh, her and me both. Another thing I can relate to the new Chloe about. You have all sorts of stuff in common. I, I do love... I, I also like... It. She has a little hot dog stuffed animal. I know, he's so I cute. I have a pizza slice stuffed animal. Yeah. Called Slice. His name is Slice. His name is Slice. He's from New York. Yeah. Where else would he be from? New York pizza. Yeah. His catchphrase is, oh, oh hi, hi. I'm, I'm Slice. slice. That's a serious <laughs> You can tell her nothing. that exists. <laughs> her child. She can't even feel the grass now. At least Chloe doesn't weigh that much. Oh man, she has to use that ventilator just to breathe. Max, you're coming over here empty-handed again. There's the water, it's over there. I need to examine things! I still can't believe I put Chloe in that chair. Max, you have the biggest guilt trip over literally everything. Seriously, you save, there is one more person alive now, thanks to your choice. Than before. And it's one of those things where it's like, oh, I, I can't believe I put Chloe. Max is such a Debbie Downer. She is. I can't believe I put Chloe in that chair. But then it's like, it's I can't believe I didn't write to Chloe for years and sent her down a path of rebellious teenage self destruction. Right? Everything isn't about you, Max. I can't believe and that I didn't know that Rachel Amber existed and now she's kidnapped and that's, I feel, that's my fault. Seriously, too. this is like a, this, is this just a, all a metaphor for like teenage self-centeredness? Self-flagellation. Which, which we all have, but it's like, Chloe's message I'm sorry, Max, accident. like, it's she just not about me. you. It, I didn't add much. Sometimes it's about Bad somebody Max. else. I didn't add much. Bad Max, <gasps> we were hopping through time. <gasps> we were literally jumping through time. Stop making me Game, right? game, stop guilt tripping me. Square Enix, God. stop guilt tripping me. I'm not, I don't feel guilty. I did, had, right? I had control. It's nice my parents sent a card at least. My parents sent a card. What's, Chloe, you know we love you and you're in our hearts and thoughts. We hope you to see your smiling face soon. Please be well. 
thinking I of you. Who this is. Kind of a generic card. Thinking of you, dear Chloe. I'm so sorry for what happened. Know that I'm here for you if you need anything. I hope you feel better, and I hope to see you again, Megan. Kind of a Megan. generic card. Huh. Here's the thing, and and I do have this problem with like sympathy cards and things, where what do you say in a lot of cases? It's it, that's hard, right? Like words can only do so much, and you end up like reciting a lot of those cliches. Wasn't very yeah. Available to Chloe. It's Real it's nice. tough. Like a lot of times it's hard to find the right words because you recognize that there's not much you can do outside of just like thinking about them and, and sympathy cards always feel really trite and they like do. and like not enough and not personal at all. It's like, oh, hope thing that you're sad about becomes better in whatever way is relevant. Like it's it's right. not personal. It's it's hard because yeah. you are so limited in what you can do. Anyway, oh, we we wrote her letter. How nice. Okay, let's see what it says. Chloe, just thought I'd drop you a quick note to let you know I'm thinking about you. I feel so lame writing shit like I hope you are well, etc. I know your life is so different now, and I don't want that to get in the way of our friendship. Yes, I haven't been around lately, but that will change soon. I hope you are well. I mean, it's personal. It is. That's like that's not she, a she bad rec letter. She recognizes her feelings. She's like, I feel really lame writing this. Like. Things are different for you now, but this hey, we're we're still self friends. Self I'll say that a lot. Oh look, I'm sure it's hot dog shirt. Great. That hot dog is awesome. Right? Kind of want that hot dog. Right? Oh, Pretty cool. Man. All right, what do we got? Bathroom. Man, Joyce and William built a whole new bathroom for Chloe. They're so they are They're so, so great. great. I should offer to put makeup on for Chloe. Not that I can. Not that I can. It would be fun. It's just not that hard, honey. Best friend does my makeup, right? It's like, who's the person who's having a hard time here? Right? Like, it's so hard to put on other people's makeup. I guess I could try, but I'll probably fail. But that's what we should do tomorrow when we do special GT Live on set. What, girlfriend from, does my makeup? So no, incredible. no, makeup artist does your makeup. There will be a real makeup artist on the set tomorrow. That's true. Chloe's still She ever come and heart. give you a smoky eye. But she can't stage dive anymore. This is a great idea. That's so cool She's ignoring that Chloe it. has made friends But it's a great idea. That's so cool. She's made friends. Welcome to Hot Wheels chat room. Hey! Handy bot for your safety. Don't give any personal information. Great. Miss Blue, what are you doing? Talking to you. Ha ha. No shit. I'm about to binge on Quantum Leap. OMG. Love Scott Bakula rules. I love Scott Bakula's name just in general. Uh, not here. Ba -ba -ba. Okay. Bakula. Okay. Great. All right. So she's got friends. Kind of. Yeah. Whoa. Chloe can totally control her computer. That's cool. It's so great people get this high-tech help. Right? I saw, when we saw, um, mm -hmm. the, the Stephen Hawking musical, what was it, cre or musical? <laughs> the, the Stephen it was not a musical. <laughs> uh, when we saw the Stephen Hawking movie, that was incredible. Like, what he's able to do, oh, yeah. despite being paralyzed and being able to manipulate things with his breath, and that's incredible. And the tools that they have for helping people to communicate just by like the movement of their eyes. It's, it's so phenomenal. cool. It's so cool. There's the old Chloe. Okay. Huh. Instead of handing Chloe a bong, I'm feeding her <laughs> water. Did I give her a choice? Instead of, I, I should be handing her a bong right now. I should be feeding How? her dank weed addiction. How? What? Oh man. Marijuana is yeah, not addictive. I know it is an addiction. Yeah. THC is not addictive. I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever? I know that from a theoretical standpoint. You didn't know the choices. Would How would you get right a podcast? Dude, I am a pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. It was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. Oh my gosh, Max, so get over it. Uh, Max. It seems like we were kids in real life. What do you remember? Yeah. What do you remember about us as kids? We all have. I want to learn more about the years that I skipped. What happened? Running and jumping through Arcadia Bay. Me too. But we're still pirates in our own way. <laughs> yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. No way will I get on a fucking boat now. Unless you're with me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. You have me? I guess. You have me. 
I'm not yeah. leaving you, Chloe. Well, oh, man, where's this on? Lot either. I mean, I loved your cards and photos, but... I know I wasn't around much. No loves her time! I'm a loser. Had no control. But, right? I am trying to make things right. So you're trying to make things oh. right. Dude, you're not super max. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. Are they okay? No, are you lonely? No. Uh... Ooh, I don't know. They love you? I just went through all the all the options. Uh, I know, right? This is a hard one. Uh, do we want to keep it on her? Or do we want to ask about? Let's ask about them. I think how, so. How are they doing? Yeah. Are they okay? I mean, are they so happy together and everything? So now you're Doctor Bill. I guess they're good. Doctor Phil. Have to deal with me. They laugh. Guess his name was trademarked. Apparently, he's trademarked. <laughs> so busy too. I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks, and the medical bills are fucking insane. Mm. Can they pay? Can they pay all the bills? <laughs> no way. They keep the numbers away from me, but it doesn't take much research to find out I'm costing my parents almost a million dollars a year. Chloe, mm. you're priceless. Uh. Uh, mm. No pun intended. All right, that's that's a tough one. You are such a geek. Uh, of course, I know a geek when I be one. See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when we'd spend the night at my house. What do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know, I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. I know. You would look incredible with blue hair. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get the show ah. on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when you watch movies. Oh my gosh. I remember See, things. Chloe and I also share that so in common. Fall asleep. Falling asleep during movies? No, oh. You're here. It's. It's ridiculous. Can't right. make it five minutes into those things. I think I have a picture of her with That must hair. be her mighty morphine machine. Go for it. Go for it. Yeah. What do we got? Bongs for her. <laughs> she seems much happier. She, she does. She seems really happy. Slightly, slightly cuddlier too. A little cuddlier. Slightly more endangered. I was about to say, closer to being extinct. Oh, look at little Chloe blue hair. Who's that sent by? That is sent by Cat at Cat Frenzel. Oh, Cat Frenzel. Aww. That's Thanks, cute. Cat Frenzel. Frenzel Cat. Frenzy Cat. And also, uh, ev everyone in the chat is guys. Guys, we're not gonna kill Chloe. Just, just calm down. Is that an option? Put her out of her misery. Everyone was wants. Option? Everyone's like, kill her. Wow, is that an option? No way. I don't think we should do that. That would be, that would be mean. We would be meanies. I uh, think you missed a grain stuck in my eyeball. Hard to believe how just a little <coughs> sand can cause such a big mess. It's like that Chinese proverb. It's like how one it's small change. It's fire that burns the entire it's prairie. It's like butterfly effect. Oh, butterfly thing. <laughs> there it is. So I've heard. There it is. Ever. I feel like on the channel and on the live stream, we should always have one game going that has like a butterfly effect theme. <gasps> it seems to be a common theme in the games we've been supplies. choosing. Like, always. She has to use a lot of lotion to keep her blood circulating. Bracelet, we looked at that, 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 looked at that. Snow globe, snow dough. We've rifled through everything? Nope. Oh. Got, there we go. <sighs> Here's the DVD. DVD case, let's open this guy. Oh my god, I made that mix for her when we were 12. Pirate power! That's cute. Not to be confused with puppet power. Nope. DVD, man. Chromecast that. <laughs> right? Chromecast all the way. Our laptops don't even have DVD, like, drives anymore. I know. We can't do anything with those. Get that external drive. Right? This is nice. Aww. Blade Runner. A classic Harrison Ford. What? 
It is. I thought it was okay. It's not my favorite. I have never seen Blade Runner. Really? I know. I thought we watched it's it together. Really, no, we oh. didn't. Well then. That must have been some other girl. <laughs> must have. <laughs> <laughs> maybe it was, I don't know. What? I was going to say maybe it was some other guy, but I don't know. No. No. No, definitely not. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. Oh, look who fell asleep, Max. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of those movies that, like, you should see. I can't help I know. It's such a classic. I know. so fast. How dare you. I know you were beat down after the day with me. And Blade Runner is a pretty dreamy movie to watch at night. Um, do, you, do you think Deckard is a replicant? Spoiler alert! <gasps> sorry, I can see you're not wide awake. Oh my gosh. Me. No. I haven't seen it. I'm Jeez. sorry I crashed so hard. <laughs> Were you okay? I do have a Is Deckard a replicant? That's just a theory. A film oh, theory. Get the out of town. Mickey. Yesterday was such a blast. See, she's having fun. It's great Aww. seeing you. I know things were different when we were just dorky kids, but being with you made me feel like when we were little pirates, jumping and running through the forests again. It meant a lot to me just to chill out with you and, and bullshit. <sighs> Fuck. Um, I'm getting my regular head pains. Uh, can you, pretty please, go upstairs and get my my morphine injector in the bathroom? Morphine injector? It's. Uh, it's total Star Trek shit. You can't even see the needle. Seriously, I, I need it. Um, my parents keep the swag upstairs because they think I can't get to it. But you can, Max. Like a pirate, right? I'm on it, Chloe. All right. Okay. Cool. We, Help. we can handle that. Being helpful. We're totally good friends. Right? Look at us. Making up for Do years of neglect, window? apparently. Yeah, I, I guess so. I can't. Chloe was a straight A student. Oh, man. Look, straight A's. She gone to Look at that. College. What a bastard. I totally should have let Chloe steal your bullshit fund. It wouldn't have Even mattered. We're in a different timeline. Okay, yeah, if, if another reality. Okay. Mr. and Mrs. Price, as principal, I am in sympathy with your numerous requests for Chloe's special needs in regards to her wheelchair and class accessibility. Blackwell prides itself on making sure students with disabilities receive full compliance under the Americans with Dis Disabilities Act. However, given that the campus and buildings have all been constructed pre-1977, our school has not yet undergone the modern renovations necessary to fulfill all the needs of your daughter and her regrettable condition. Sadly, with recent deplorable federal cuts in education, it will take many more fundraisers to fully update Blackwell Academy, but that day will come. Chloe is without doubt an amazing student with great potential despite her handicap, and I believe she would find a more fitting, rewarding, scholastic environment at the H. West Miskatonic Institute in Bolton. Hmm. They have such a rich legacy of disabled graduates, and I know that Chloe would achieve her usual academic leadership in more comfortable surroundings. With her outstanding GPA, there's no doubt that that school would welcome Chloe with open halls. Miskatonic. Whatever. Whatever. I hope, fine, I hope you'll seriously consider this suggestion as I'm sure your daughter would prefer to attend a school that can cater her to, to her many needs. In the same spirit, I've also enclosed brochures to other potential schools in the Oregon region. If you have any questions, please contact my office. Isn't that illegal? Like, aren't they required by nature to be, like... To, I, to conform? Uh, if it's a private institution, maybe not, right? Is that the difference here? He did mention cuts Despite to everything. public schools, They're though. Still a happy right. Again. I am a little confused, but, but I don't know. Mystery, I don't know. Chloe really loves skating too. Yeah. See, that's the, like I but thought. But there may be some that are like grandfathered in if they were built a long time ago. Maybe like, more than forty years ago or something. Um. But the other thing I say there is like, hey, no big loss leaving Blackwell. Blackwell kind of sucks. Right? You got like, like sociopathic kids running around. Yeah, let's be honest here. It is a bunch oh, of rich, spoiled kids. Her new room is the garage. Damn. This is just for Chloe's basic supplies. How much is this per month? 85, 87. <sighs> per uh. month. Yikes. All right. Oof. That's rough. Bonjour. That's great they finally went to Paris. That's cool. They went to Paris. That is cool. Here, Aww. my buddy Victoria. 
Max, are we cool? Just wanted to make sure since you walked away so fast. Nathan was worried too. Uh oh. If you want to talk, hit me up, Kay. Love you! Max, if you're mad, just tell me, Kay. Silence. So if you want to talk, my door's open. Love you! Ooh. Why? I, I would like to text her back. Right? Let me text her back. So that way people don't hate me. <sighs> Don't pout left. Hey, honey, I hope you didn't forget the water the plant I gave you, but don't drown me either. Oh, so is my plant alive again? God! I get a second chance with my plant! Do we? Yes! Uh. Wait, who's this? This is Taylor. Max! Max, thanks again for taking me to see my mom. I think she wants you for a daughter instead of me. Everybody loves Max. She's so popular. I think not. Your mom is a badass like you. Yeah, right. I cried like a bitch. So did I. You just didn't see me. It's okay to cry. It gets old. My stupid phone is about to die, so call me back. And I like that her phone actually died. Yeah. Nathan. What's my buddy Nathan? Ooh. Developing shots for the contest. Oh, man. I'm tight with Nathan Prescott. Oh, no. So no two whales for you. Not yet. I'll see you guys later, though. Peace out. Oh, man. Oh, I'm tight. I'm tight with Nathan. What does that say about you? Right? I, it does make me concerned about Max. Hello, Max. This is William. Wait. What? Oh, wait. hello, Max. This is William. Oh, yeah. If you want to contact Chloe, you can use this number. Oh, wait. This is like her yeah, dad. She would, yeah. Oh, <laughs> she'd love to hear from you. See you soon. I hope. I hope. Bye. Hey, Chloe. Maxine here. I know it's been a while. I just wanted to let you know I'm going to Blackwell Academy now. I hope this is still your number. Max is back. Blackwell, that's so awesome. You rule. Best of all, we can hang out again. So yes, this is still my number. Cool, I've got a buttload of homework, but we'll get together soon. Don't tease me. It's been so it's been too long. I know, I'll see you soon. Half high five. Half high five, yeah, there you go. Uh Hey Max, it's a shame that you hang out with those people. I thought you were different. Alyssa, I saw you throw that TP at me. OMG, I was so not aiming at you, I swear. Don't do it again. Whoa, Max is Max. like laying down the law. Oh, You're so, so can I talk to her about Paris? No. Yeah. That I unlock this dialogue option? Let's do it. Uh, maybe you want to get her morphine. I need to talk to her first about Paris. All right, fine. Paris! Just keep her so, in pain, why don't you? you? sure it is. She's just, like, dying. Hanging out with me like this? I, I want to learn more about my friend. No way. I don't want you to feel weird. My life is just so different than yours. I mean, you can't just bounce out of here and... I'll be doped up half the day in pain, so that's cool. But I do feel grateful that I can see the ocean, that I have parents who love me, and that my best friend is here with So me. are we gonna get the option? Exactly. To go back. So, or not. What else do you need? I think well, so. I feel like we are. Hot monkey sex would be nice. Ooh, hot monkey sex. <laughs> what? Oh, look. I mean, it's I the need for blush. everyone. So, are you dating anyone at Blackwell? Not, Not really. really. Not really. No. Like Nathan, Nathan Prescott. Uh -huh. there, but you know me. I'm too damn shy. Which is stupid because you're so damn cool. Some bro has to be crushing on you. I was supposed to go Some out with bro. this guy named Warren. Warren. I don't think he's into me anymore. I, I, I totally ship Warren. He's... You need to move on. Girl. Not her. The, the other girl. He loves the other girl. It's Not this girl. whole game again, Stephanie. They are not meant to be. They're not meant to be. Do you like having him around? Of course. He's my hero. I swear he would do anything for me or mom. Wish I could do something for him. You have. You're here with your family. That's true. Yeah. yeah they're here for me. But then so are you. So it's all good. See, it is all good. Right? All right. You saved her hero. No, I, trust me, I'm kind of, like, if I were given the choice, if I were given the choice right now of whether to go back and go back to the original timeline. They gave Chloe their giant expensive HDTV. I and they feel used her like I would. Television. Hey, there's nothing wrong with that tube television. No shame. I think my parents to had one of those until I two years ago. To goddamn car keys. Uh, okay. Let's talk to William. These whales are just a preview of the tornado to come. And the Prescott Foundation? What about the Prescott Jesus. Foundation? Jesus. 
What? Beached uh, angels looking for the whales, whereas the shores of Arcadia Bay once acted as a lovely gateway to the Pacific and beyond, now locals and tourists face the sad, surreal image of gray whales that inexplicably swam to land and to their doom. The whale pods were spotted early morning on Wednesday, October 9th, and within a few hours, at least half a dozen were dead or dying on the shore. Smartphone footage does not reveal any unusual ocean conditions or excessive pollution. Meanwhile, ecologists and marine biologists from across the country are carefully studying samples from the whales and environment. The Prescott Foundation has vowed to provide extra research funds given the local scope of the eco-mystery. That's oh, nice man. of the Rachel Prescott Andrews Foundation. It's not mystery. a mystery. It's just the coming apocalypse, you guys. Search for the popular teen continues. Black right. Honor student Rachel Amber has not been seen in over six months, yet her family and friends have only intensified the search for the 18-year-old Arcadia Bay resident. Police and FBI have few leads and little information in the case, which has caught the interest of national reality show, Where Did They Go? <gasps> awesome. Yes, reality TV. The Amber family has offered a reward for any information. For more details. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Paper. They might get their own home taken away because of medical bills. Ooh. Oh, no. That's terrible. Oh, no. This letter is to notify you that you are in default of your payment obligations on your home loan. The current account holds the amount of $12,000 payable uh. by August 1st, 2013. This amount has been overdue since March 1st, 2009, and you have ignored multiple requests to make a payment or reconsolidate your debt. Unless the full amount of $12,000 is received within 15 days, we must begin the foreclosure for foreclosure foreclosure process on your home. We've given you more than adequate notice on the issue, and we have no other options left. Donald Clamp lenders, not to be confused with Donald Trump. No. But clearly a reference oh, to Oh, man. Him. Hey, William. Um, am I bothering you? Why, yes, Max. I love going through bills. <laughs> Kidding. How can you bother me? I haven't seen you in forever. I know. He's so nice. You look right? exactly I can't go back to the other timeline where he's dead. <laughs> it's that so suck. cool. Good. Or I'd be a scared if I didn't look like me. <laughs> I'd be a scared. Of course, you seem more adult now. So what's on your mind? Uh, uh, lots of stuff, apparently. Yeah. Paris, Paris trip. trip. So you finally made it to Paris. Oui, as they say. <laughs> <laughs> Not me, because I can't speak French. But it was a great experience, especially for Chloe. I can see her loving it there. You guys rock for going on a family adventure like that. She talked about going to school there. But that's not practical anymore. It's not fair, Max. All right, let's oh. talk about let's talk Joyce. Yeah, being around you and Joyce again is so nostalgic. Very old school, as they say. <laughs> I think it's great for Chloe to see you. Makes Joyce happy too. So it's not all bad news in Arcadia Bay, or is it? Oh man. Uh, let's talk about. The Prescott family. Yeah. The Prescott family might be bad news. What do you think about them? Evil. Next question. Sounds oh, like you're right. well. More than I want to. But Joyce has to work for those greedy bastards at Pan Estates. I don't even like to think about it. She works at Pan Estates? Apparently. Let's talk about crazy weather. Let's talk about the crazy what weather. What do you think is going on with all of this crazy weather and animals dying? Nobody knows, right? It is Nostradamus type shit, pardon my French. I thought you didn't no, speak I French! William, you are so full of lies! Come on now. My Get your story straight. We brought you back from the dead for somewhere. crying out loud. Rachel Amber? Liar. Oh, yeah, she Pat. went to black. Liar, right? William. Oh, poor thing. That's a real nightmare for a family. I get scared thinking about Chloe and that we might lose her someday. <sighs> Let's talk uh -oh. about Chloe. Yeah, let's, let's explore that a little. This, Good segue. Aww. I'm truly sorry about what happened to Chloe. Me too. All it takes is a few minutes to change her ass. Oh, life. the guy swerved and she fell. She's alive. Yeah. She She's is alive. Glad you're here. Yeah. She's amazing. I'm so glad you're here to help her and be her father. I'm so glad Joyce is here to help us both. Max, I. Just hate to think of what would happen to Chloe if I wasn't here. Mm. Okay. William. I, I feel like I know where this is going. Whatever happens, I'll always be here for Chloe. 
He's a great oh, guy. Nice. I know yep. you will. Max. If we stay in this timeline, Chloe's going to end up dying of yes. her injuries or something else. His wishes are that no matter what, she's Chloe alive, that live. Chloe gets to live. And because he's such a great guy, we're going to end up honoring his wishes and going back to the other timeline. I can see that. I, I think I. By Chloe's that's name. my. I, I call it. Oh, I think that's where this is going. I think that's a fair sure assessment. We could buy a few mansions for what it all costs. The insurance helps, but I, I don't know, Max. I know it must be hard on you guys. It's right. yeah. It's gonna like be his, his dying wish, and, like and then we're gonna have to go back it. and tell Chloe we that we went to the other timeline and it was his dying wish or something, and that's gonna be the thing that finally turns your life around. Is always right. I don't know. Maybe Chloe's yeah. life doesn't get turned around. Maybe no? it doesn't. I have to go see if, if she continues koala ko around. It was so great talking with you again. You act like it's the last time. And please, keep me from these bills whenever you want. That's my prediction, though. That's that's my prediction. That's just your theory. What? No change to spare anymore. Now it's back to cookies. Hey, I'll take cookies, man. It's an it's a okay trade-off. Coupon boss. <sighs> coupon boss. Speaking of cookies, have you seen Extreme Savers or Extreme Couponers? Oh, they where, are nuts. Where they will get, like... Tons and tons of groceries for free simply because they get like all these deals using their coupons. If you, I don't need, so I think they've nerfed a lot of coupons since those shows came out. I don't, I don't I wonder so if you can even do that anymore. I don't know because. But back in this timeline, you probably could. Oh this yeah. Is far back enough that yes. you could still do that stuff. No, if you've ever watched these shows, people will walk into a grocery They're store with literally like fifty or eighty just coupons. To take care yep. of their They'll buy massive Such amounts bullshit. of stuff like. They'll buy 40 rolls of toilet, love, like packages of toilet paper, and then their balance at the end of their shopping trip will Joyce end up being like ten dollars or something because of all the coupons. Yep. And just the way they use them. Not even. Sometimes, no. sometimes they get paid to get stuff. It's yeah, great. It's crazy. It's like, oh yeah, it's triple coupon day, and so we're paying you 25 cents for everything that you're getting or yeah. whatever. It's crazy. Here we go. Let's see your room. That's empty. Makes sense. It does. We have to move downstairs. All right. Her room downstairs is pretty spacious. It's pretty nice. Blue butterfly. I'm sure this is a total coincidence. I bet it's not. Nah. I bet it's symbolic. That's not really this game's jam. <laughs> At least we never had to hide from step douche. It's true. That's true. I guess we stopped growing up together. Yep. Okay. Sit. Oh, you sit. get to you get to flashback. I get to sit and ponder. I'm still overwhelmed by this new reality. Oh man. This is a thinking moment. I, I so would be too, to, to be honest. Oh yeah, of course. You go back to a completely different timeline, even if it's better, whatever. The choice of keeping William alive. I think you would actually go through a lot of these same thought processes in in all like in all reality. Mm. It's true. It is a tough call, right? Because also you can give the information to Chloe, but Chloe can't make the choice because no. she doesn't know, right? She, like she can't know what it's actually like in both places at once. The grass is always greener on the other side of the timeline. I never heard much about William's brother. Oh, William's brother. Oh. Hey, Bill. Sorry for not staying in touch since the accident. Uh, work has been piling up, and I'm being sent to Salt Lake City to oversee a new parking lot. You have to go where the work is these days. I wish we could have sent you the bigger check, but you know the story. Money yeah. is nobody's favorite thing. Maybe I'll see you next spring for a visit. Kiss Chloe and Joyce for me. Hang in there, Billy. Your br brother, Aaron. Oh, man, so he's already borrowed money from Shoes. his family. Shoes. Chloe always did love stomping around in her boots. She is. Oh my god. Boys? She is. I kind of want to open this and see what's in here. Do you it. Do it. I, I can't. This is like the Earthbound Halloween hack. They're tempting me with choice and then I can't actually choose. Ah! The choice is not mine to make. They bought crutches for Chloe, hoping she might walk again. Too bad Joyce and William can't get any help from the Prescott Foundation. 
Dear Joyce, thank you for keeping me updated on Chloe's condition. I can only imagine you, the struggle you and William are going through. I'm so sorry that I can't help you with a loan at this time. Like everybody else, I'm underwater with my own medical bills. Please give Chloe a hug and my best wishes. Love, Aunt Dorothy. 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 That's what I said, uh -oh. Dorothy. And Dorothy. What do you Do think I said? You said, you, you said Aunt Dorothy. You said, you said Dorothy. Aunt Do Dor Dorothy. Aunt Dorothy. <laughs> Say it one more time. Aunt Dorothy. <laughs> Fun fact: if if enough people live in the same, this was a this was a good uh, tweet I saw the other day. It's all about you. If a, if enough people Isn't live it? in the same part of the world and share the same speech impediment, it becomes an accent. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, that's that, that makes a sense. lot of sense. Apparently, the only thing that hasn't changed is this view. And Dorothy hasn't changed. She's still dealing with the medical problems. Who? And Dorothy. Oh, okay. Jason, pull up some tweets or something. Oh, Max, it is so Whoa, nice let's barge in on Joyce. You. Right? Wait, not now. Maybe she was like naked in here. What are you doing? Yeah, before I before I talk to people, let's let's call out some 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 peeps, some folk. Oh my gosh, that's adorable! Some fan art from Jay. Oh my gosh, that's Fish so cool. Fish face, 480. Fish face. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's awesome. Hope you enjoy this fan art. I, I do. It's got Blaine Jason, Perv Pat. Yes! Per, it's got Perv Pat, that's great. Good for Chloe to stay in my hair is my, my hair is strangely long though. Oh wait, no, that's Stephanie. Uh, uh. What? I was making a joke over the confusion about how I couldn't tell the two apart. Yeah, you were you were really the confused about that. The Are very voluptuous, thank you. Mm -hmm. that's, mm -hmm. that's I've always been exactly jealous. Just, just wait, confused. just wait till you see girlfriend does my makeup. Mm. Mm. You were not really confused. There's so much cool fan art that gets sent on the stream. You but... were you were not really confused about that. Ah. Uh, you were not. No. Don't be mean. <gasps> Joyce used to hate smokers in the diner. Meanwhile, Faith Patterson says, Dorothy. Dorothy, says Faith Patterson. Also, and, Julian Owen says, Aunt Dorothy. And, and so does Shanawaz also says, Dorothy. Everyone wants us to kill Chloe still. I don't, I really just don't. I don't also, this is I Dr. This I'm is really a saying, super mom that. by Dr. Bill. Not to be confused with Dr. Phil, who, who apparently has trademarked right? the title doctor followed by the name Phil. Which is very strange. Look at them. They have no idea what's in their future. Dude, these guys are happy. Right? I... They're, they're in some financial trouble, it's true. such a sweet true. shelf, Chloe. I wonder who took the picture. But they have so... I, they have more time together as a happy family. I, it's tough. I is trying so Money hard. Money is and everything. Oh, He's man. still awesome. I don't. I don't know if I trust Doctor Bill's advice. If this is the the cover of the book that he is, right? Super Dad, be the family hero, and this is the image that you've selected for the cover of your book, Doctor Bill. It's definitely like creeper stash plus that. Right? Is that a mullet? It, I think it's, that's it's a mullet. It's like starter mullet with like starter mullet with, with pedo aviators. Stash, like greasy <gasps> shirt. And what's going on in the car back there? That, it's, Is it like two people like hanging out like, yeah? No, it's it's the kidnap van. I think that's like right? I think that's like the satellite coming off the kidnap van. Oh, the Maybe satellite. he's off the grid. <sighs> that's, how, that's how you become super dad. That's that a, legs dangling out the back. <laughs> the, the legs of the dead. Good All right, here we go. Max. Oh, you and Chloe are so much quieter now than Because I'm stealthing house. around your house. Remember, right? It's nice. We I'm definitely pawing through again. all of your stuff. Oh, William and I love it. Finally seeing you and Chloe together after all these years. Everyone rubs it in. Right? I was traveling through time. I saved his life. I'm Doctor Who over here. H how about people thank me for saving his life? No? Talk about William. I have to tell you how much I love seeing you and William together again. He's been such a hero through all this. Chloe and I... Lucky to have Lucky him. Lucky to have him. Damn straight. You're welcome, Joyce. Well, uh, Chloe and William. Yeah, Chloe and William. Chloe and William seem like they still get along so good. Yeah, so well. Closer now more than ever. You're better than that grammar, oh, Max. Actually Come on, Max. To William, well, she usually Max is not a straight student. Oh, it's so cute. That's just Chloe. Huh. 
You rule, Joyce. Shit. Things would be different if I did. I like how you think, kid. You, you know what would have been really funny? If you go back in time and you're like, hey, Joyce and William, you should really think about investing in Apple stock. <gasps> I have a hot, I have a, a, a suspicion that this Apple thing is really going to take off. I can turn around your whole financial future here. <laughs> hey, Chloe, have you ever thought about starting a YouTube channel about beauty tutorials? Makeup guru. You could do it. And also dyeing your hair. The best YouTubers have the blue hair. Right? Could have been. They all have a blue hair phase. You can too. Right? Max, th this is this is what you should have been doing. Seriously. Not just hiding keys in some or throwing keys out the window. Right. Should have been like, huh? Wow, this Google that I'm hearing so much about these days is a very interesting company. As a tax savvy savvy young kid. That Facebook thing. That might that might take off someday. What are you doing? Have you ever walked up to I'm any of your parents' friends, by the way, or your your well, friends' I, parents, and been like, "Let's talk about you right now." Max is just mature that way. I'm 20 years younger than you, and don't really have any understanding of what you're going through in life. But let's talk about you here Do for you a minute. Talk about David, David Madsen. Madsen. Uh, what? He. Um, I'm really curious what happened to him. Two whales. Well, that was random. <laughs> he yeah, was. He's a, a bus driver. He comes in sometimes. Cute, quiet. Why? Oh, um, uh, I, w I was just cute. Curious. Joyce. Joyce with that wandering nice eye. That everything doesn't change. Eco habit. So, what do you think is going on here with all of this? So, Joyce, I see you sitting Maybe privately alone on your bed with the door shut. Let's talk about eco havoc. I have a feeling. <gasps> Honestly, I don't give a shit about too much outside our house. I don't blame you, Joyce. Except now we have dead birds and beach whales outside our front door. That is a little bit of a bummer. So maybe I should care, for Chloe's sake. Plus, you guys have to work too. Ah, uh, Bill and I have no time for ourselves. We're working more than we're no time for ourselves. Maybe Except I these like hours I'm whiling away reading this magazine. <laughs> <laughs> you know While ignoring presents? that my you daughter needs Sean a morphine injection downstairs. Jeez, Joyce. Actually, she's really nice. I can't really pick that on her. Nathan. That was, that was I wish astute of you to notice, though. <laughs> I know Chloe doesn't get many visitors. Oh, Max, you're Chloe's best friend for a reason. You're here exactly when she needs you. There you go. I hope Amen. so. I hope so. You guys do such an amazing job taking care of her. We've and Max is real so much, And she gets damn sick of her parents. <laughs> That's why it's so important you came to spend time with her. Max, Chloe's condition is not improving. Her respiratory system is very weak and she, she, do you know what I'm saying? Choice. I'm so sorry you have to go through all this. Bad or good, I embrace every moment with my daughter and my husband. Maybe this is should. what it means to be a family and we'll always be one. Aww. No matter Aww. what. Choice is the best. Choice is awesome. It's good talking with you, Joyce. Speaking of that, Me too, honey. Uh, yeah, I is NC says, Chloe's in pain, get the morphine already. I need to get information about the world I around me and what has happened so I can make an educated decision about what I need to do. Dear Mr. and Mrs. Price, as we discussed last week, Chloe's respiratory system is showing signs of rapid weakening. This is to your point. Mm -hmm. This supports your theory. This accounts for her recent anemia and loss of breath. As a doctor, I'm committed to her well-being, but I want you to understand the reality of respiratory failure is common in people with severe spinal injuries. Your daughter is one of the bravest, strongest patients I've ever had, and I'm proud to be working with her. I just want you as parents to prepare for any and all possibility. I believe Chloe should be made aware of her changing condition. If you would like to discuss further, you have my contact that info. Sh shouldn't that open up more dialogue boxes f for Chloe? Like, what, so, do we, are we the one who are going to drop no, the bomb? No, no, to find out what she knows about her own condition. You would hope so. I'm surprised that we can't, it's, like, This is like a Toby Fox game. There. It, it alludes to me having choice when I don't. God, Toby Fox. I'd like to point out that you guys said all the best YouTubers have blue hair. Yes. <gasps> oh! oh, my Ooh. God. 
cool. I love oh, it. Oh, that is so awesome. And also, Chloe the panda. <laughs> I don't, know, I don't know where it's the close. panda comes from. It, it's from Joe Jangle. Joe Jangle? That is Jangle so cool. Oh, I, oh, like I, it. I, I, I like so it. want so want. I've never blue gotten blue colored hair. hair before. Right? Me either. He All says, the... Matt Pat and Stephanie with a panda. <laughs> uh, <laughs> by Jangle. Because, because of reasons. I like it. I'm I, into it. I feel I would Maybe be more of a. Skip. Maybe it's like, an interpretation of skin. I feel like I would be more here, of a here, buddy. purple hair. Person? Well, I don't know. It, I don't know what color. Here, wait. Be. I think it. I think it's. I think it goes for. It's like skip. Look. It see? is. Oh yeah. I totally see it. With blue nice. hair. Oh, skip. How do you like blue hair? Is it fun? Do you like blue hair, Skip? Skip. Mm. Skip. Do you like blue hair? No, he has, he has nothing to say. <gasps> He's being oddly quiet for the He's, like first time ever. He's like, eh, it's okay. I prefer pink. Anyway, hey! Okay, let's play on. How's it going, play Time Tripper? It's funny. I think. Here it is. Here we go. I never thought I'd be delivering Let's keep morphine. Let's keep getting the morphine. To my best never thought friend. I'd be delivering morphine to my best friend. We're just dank morphine. bud. Just dank bud. And her ball. looks almost the same. Just, just tools just with which she can get her chemical on. <gasps> You're just so self medication yeah. for a recreational sense. Nothing here. Not, not in like a actual like life saving cool. way. Chloe uses natural medicine too. Ooh, using that natural medicine. Here, I'll preserve the lights. Look at me being socially conscious. All right. Downstairs. Here we go. So I think we got a good survey of the new situation right now. Just say, dear sir, you are scared. Oh, this used to be the garage. The other half of the garage. Here we go. Finally. Uh, give me the blue pill. I'm sorry. Matrix I still came out in this timeline. Yes. <laughs> go ahead and plug it right in. It's so easy. And painless. Um, okay, but get ready to yell for your folks if I screw up. Oh, trust me. I will. Does right. Chloe, Chloe look worse now? Does she look... Of course, more my sick all of a sudden. Getting worse. No. But you caught me on a good day. Max, I'm so grateful that I'm even able to hang out with you. See, I'm getting mushy. Hmm. I'm already high. I wonder if she knows. Sorry, I bet she does. Do you I think so. Her parents would also be the type to um, tell her. Stop me if I'm being too I emo. I don't know. But can you grab one of the I can see them having a hard there? time telling her because it's I really they really love her. Anyone. Of, of course. But. Please. My diary is like emo ground zero. Plus Believe Max that. Caulfield does not pass up a photo op with Chloe Price. Ever. All right, let's do it. All right. Where's the photo album? Over here. Got it. Boom. Look at this. Accomplishing yeah. challenges left and right. Photo album. There we go. Max is actually looking rougher than Chloe, quite honestly. <laughs> oh my god. Look how little we are there. We look like toys. I remember that day by the light. I wouldn't know. I wasn't able to open the box in the attic. He actually tried to give us or a time upstairs. out. And you laughed at him. <laughs> my dad would have banished me. Turn page. Whoa, awesome picture. We look so badass in our pirate gear. We should have taken over Arcadia Bay when we had the chance. There's still time for you. She knows. Oh, yeah. She knows. Yep, it's true. Can I do anything else? I'm just interested to see. Nope, okay. Oh, man. There we are making pancakes. I love that shot of us. It's hard to believe my dad took that picture only five years ago. Hmm. Literally, mm. seems like yesterday. It was, because we traveled through time. Me too. This photo... Maybe I could... Listen, Max. My See? respiratory oh, system so she does is know. Falling, and, uh, and it's only getting worse. I've heard the doctors talking about it when they thought I was zonked out. So, I know I'm just putting off the inevitable. 
while my parents suffer along. And I will too. This isn't how I want things to end. What? What are you saying? I'm saying that being with you again has been so special. I just wanted to feel like when we were kids running around Arcadia Bay and everything was possible, and you made me feel that way today. I want this time with you. Oh no. <gasps> no, oh, no, 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 oh, I understand. Yes. What? No, what? His crank up the eye. What? What? No, no. Oh my gosh. What? <gasps> no, no. Whoa. No. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. Wow. Why would you do? No, don't do that. Oh my gosh. This is not a choice. But I mean, we're not. No. No, absolutely not. Absolutely not. I'm not even doing that in a video game. Seriously. I'm, I'm curious about this I don't know option. I mean, I think it'll prolong the conversation. Maybe. But I think it's going to come down to the same acceptor if you. No way. Wow. No way. Wow. Oh my gosh. No. Yeah, I think it's, it's, it's a refuse. Skip, don't knock over the wires. Can't. Oh my gosh. It wrecks me to see you in any pain. But I don't have That's what the chat meant, by this. the way. Yeah, I'm sure it is. <laughs> I'm giving you the right. But Joyce and William, I already said my goodbyes to them, but they won't honor my wishes. You will. I, I, I can't kill you with an overdose. I would make a joke there, but Next, it doesn't seem appropriate. From my illness, not my dosage. This accelerates the process. I'd rather go out on a wave than a rock. And I want my best friend... Oh man, friend this is dealing with some heavy out. issues. Holy I'm cow. I'm going to help you, but not like that. You have to believe me, Chloe. Why, Max? You're just bailing on me. Like oh my gosh, much. come on. Don't what guilt you trip me! You've been wanting to since you got here, right? It's funny. So go in both timelines, Chloe asks you to do stuff that she should never ask you to do. It's true. That no one should ever ask you to do. Right? Chloe has just these like unfair expectations so of what friendships stand for. She asks for she asks for things that are totally unfair actually in both. Oh my gosh. Oh my. Should I remind and try it again and see what happens? I'm I am curious what happens. I want to know. Let's do it. As long as we can go back. Yeah. I don't. Do that for me. What? <laughs> Jason. Jason, get out of here. God. I feel like there are probably other people that you would want to ask before me. <laughs> here, let's see. Yeah, because Matthew would just hit you over the head with a mallet or something. Yeah. <gasps> don't know. Go with don't know. No, I want to. I'm going to do accept. Oh, I'm curious what fine. happens. Fine. I don't. I don't really want to do it. I know you don't. I'm. Okay, fine. Let's do it. Fine, we're just playing through the option. We're just playing the, through the, the option. The chat wanted us. I'm curious. I'll just drift to sleep, dreaming of us here together, forever. Oh my God. Uh What? Thank you so much. I'm so proud of you for following your dreams. <sighs> Don't forget about me. Never. I love you, Max. See you around. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sooner than you think. Oh my gosh. Rewind. Just rewind. I don't like this option. 
People are saying rewind, you can't rewind after it. No. Go. Of course you can. Look, there the, there I am rolling. Uh, jeez. Alright, so that's an option. And then there's... And then is there the I don't know option? You want, you want to test it? I'm so curious. I'm going to say I don't know. Chloe, I really don't know if I can do this. I had another friend who wanted to end it all. And I did everything I could to try and save her life. How can I be responsible for ending yours? I mean... There's got to be another way. Max, you were there for your friend, no matter what. Now I'm asking you to help me the same way. I want to help you, Chloe, but... I, I think my help is hurting. At least you have a choice. When you want to make a decision, you can just do it. Look at me. I'm at the mercy of everybody. For once. Ooh. Oh, she makes a good point. The most important one in my life. Please. Help me, Max. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Uh. I, I can't. No, I can't. You can't? You can't do it. It's it's similar to You have to go back to the other thing. It's similar to Katie. Where Katie it was you know, you have like it looks awful, but you have so much to live for. And here, same thing, where yes, her respiratory system is failing, and that's that's really hard. But we we mentioned earlier about Stephen Hawking, right? Where like everyone's like, Hey, you're gonna die, you're you know, your body is a ruin for the rest of your life, and he went on to do great things. And so, yes, it looks awful for Chloe now, but if you take that choice, if, See, if you allow her to follow through with the choice now, it kind of ruins the potential of what there could be, right? Yeah, I mean, so you, you end the timeline. The, the difference here, though, I think, and we are not clicking accept, by the way, no way, but, oh, but I, I'm the one with the controller playing the game. No, <laughs> this is a mutual gameplay, yo. Sure. So, um, no, the difference here, I think, is Chloe. It's like she could die any minute, right? It's not like Stephen Hawking, where it's totally unclear. Maybe he lives for years. Maybe he doesn't, or something like that. I thought it was. I thought it was a similar situation because he's on a respirator too, isn't he? Uh, but his is a different. It's a totally different condition. So. I don't. I. I. I, I can't. No. Chloe. All right. So she's mad at us. She. It doesn't matter. It's the right. It's the right. Since when has Chloe made good decisions no, for herself? Trust Seriously, me, I'm, I'm, I'm well aware. Chloe's decisions are like never the right decisions. I'm well aware that Chloe's decisions. This so is, this is gonna take me back. It's in gonna time. take us Sorry. back to redo it. I don't want to redo this though either. I I disagree with this. I want to stay in this timeline and help Chloe as she's dealing with this. What? Everyone in the chat wants us to accept, by the way. <sighs> well, we, we saw both, but at the end of the day, it has to be so our See, I feel like that kind of situation is almost didn't scare you, Max. just as this much about Max being alive and having to live with the what if of if she hadn't killed her friend. Hello? Hey, honey. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the square jar. You mean your college fund? Aha! You can't hide from me forever. 
And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise See, with chocolate cake. For but dinner. now Max, you'll be here She's she's still choosing. That makes all of us. I what a I'm conflicted here. What happens if we accept? Do we still just go back to this other timeline? I don't know. I don't know. It's too late now, I think. Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like, you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. I, I did try. I'm sorry. I don't know exactly what you're talking about, but come on. You have made things different, like, my whole life. You're my best friend. I've got you and a great family. What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. I'll always have your back. Always. Well, be careful what you say because now you abandon her and come back years later and all that. Ugh. But, so I'm conflicted, right? Because now all of a sudden we've made the choice that... But I feel like we would have gone back to this other timeline anyway. No, sure. Uh, in, in terms of the game, yes. I'm talking in terms of the overall themes of this game, okay. though. In terms of gameplay, yes. We probably would have to go back to the original timeline regardless. But in terms of overall themes of this game, on one hand, she's like, oh, I'm so mad, or my help isn't helping you. But she's... And, and so I guess she's going back to the timeline as it should have happened which I guess is okay, but it's one of those things where, I don't know, like, she's choosing Chloe's life over William's life. Which is what we established what William would have wanted. We don't know. William, I, like, it, it would have been- He's a, that I, kind of dad. He would have chosen his daughter's life over his. I think, I think we can make that assumption. I'm just not convinced that, like... Where, so where are you missing the choice? I'm missing... We'll see. We'll, I'm see miss how Chloe, we'll, we'll see how Chloe... The end of Chloe's story goes. Okay. I'm just questioning whether Chloe's life in that other timeline was so much worse than her life in this timeline. It's, it's not. It's the fact that she dies. If she oh, weren't, di if she weren't going to die... In the other timeline? Oh yeah, now you suddenly want to kiss me? Uh, we'll, we'll, yeah, see, we'll see where Chloe ends up. Fine. We'll I'm see where Chloe ends up. Where I'm feeling so the lack of choices, I don't think we had a choice you about whether we came high. back to this timeline. Uh, I don't, no, I don't think we could broke. go on in the other no, timeline with your dad. CSA or Kidia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. That's actually Max, where I wish we had the choice. Did over this? I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Not anymore. I'm just spaced out too. Welcome back to the real world, Max. And I, never lose my I don't think so I can ever tell Chloe about what happened. <sighs> so I don't know about what. My question here is, what did that little foray Let's look at the do for us? To see all our pieces in the puzzle so far. Like what? What did that do? Well, I thought, so So, based on what I said before, I thought we would come back right. and tell Chloe, hey, I, I visited this other timeline. Sure. Here is how it played out. Mm -hmm. You are actually alive today because your dad sacrificed himself. Right. And so she doesn't feel anymore like her dad's abandoned her, I know. which was her fundamental problem this whole time, and that starts about her process of recovery and I moving mean, on. We'll see how it plays out. I'm curious how it plays out. Right? Hmm. Uh. I feel like we're missing a major clue. Keep digging, Chloe. I wish I could tell Chloe how much William You can! You can? Why don't you? Staying up all night is the best excuse to drink water. You can't! Matt, I like it. Here, give me the choice. I want the choice to tell her. 
I'm so sorry, William. It's not fair you had to die yeah. twice. This butterfly photo seems like a million years ago. How much time have I altered since? All right, let's check out the big okay, board. Okay, all right. The graphic says that the foray into the other timeline was supposed to teach you that bad things can have good outcomes. So close kind of? and so far away. Kind of? We have Wasn't to do it? three main it. things. Right. Um, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat step douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the darkroom. Too bad I don't have a gun anymore. Yes, that's the solution. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. You didn't even let me take that money to pay Frank off. And I'm glad. We have to be better than that. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and mom was giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. Alright. Uh, it's it's weird that we're like I back and now all of a sudden it's like with my rewind power. It's way too dangerous, and I need to navigate the present without messing up the past. That snow dough always makes me think of William and Chloe. It's it's weird that we're suddenly back and having gone through that whole adventure, there's like no real talk about it. And now all of a sudden it's like, we're on the detective story to solve this problem. Right? I'm confused. I'm a bit confused too how it connected. No. Hey, bro. Oh, no. There's Poor another one. has been trapped in here. Hey, buddy. Come on. Hey, friend. Hey. Are you in here? There yeah, he is. buddy. Hey. It's scary. Oh, you gotta open a window somewhere. Somebody open up a window. Here. I'll open a window. There. Uh, this one? Yeah. There you go. Wait, will he die out there? Uh, huh. Since the birds die? Maybe he's only alive because... Because I haven't, like, gotten rid of him. I don't know. Because he's been in the house. Did he fly away? No, he's on the shelf behind Where you. Where is he? Oh, Here. there he is. Good one. Fly. Be free. You think he belongs outside. I hope. I hope that Aww, doesn't kill him. Oh, it's a butterfly effect. Oh no. I hope it doesn't kill him. Since no, David it probably will. There, I better mosey along Gosh. for a change. Anything else interesting in here? Do, 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 do. Oh, that blue dye makes me All right. so yeah, happy. Alright, yeah, 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 blue dye. Great. It means the real Chloe is back with me. Sink. Uh. Great. Clean for pores. We're all clean. Great, Great. awesome. Turn off the light for safety. Eco-friendly. There we go. All right. I know they have bills to pay. I'm trying to help. <gasps> so there's some stuff coming through in the chat about why we shouldn't tell Chloe. OK. Is there, is there a confrontation that's going to happen here? I don't know. Are we going to throw down? Battle, Max. Oh. You broke up my family. I salute you. David. Oh. I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Aww. Don't you wander off into the dark. What? Is that a... Is that a metaphor? Right or a metaphor? I can't tell. Don't you wander off into the dark. Yeah. Or don't you wander off into the dark. Metaphorically yeah, speaking. I'm confused. Uh, Curly Fries 320, if you, if you hadn't angels. have told Chloe, she, if, if you would have told on? Chloe, she would have been pissed. She would have argued that Max could have stayed in the other reality because at least her dad would be alive. The, the risk Trust the me, that she's I would angry. like to have stayed. I, I think I would have liked to have stayed in the other reality. Right? Honestly. I mean, oh, I got all sorts of, whoa, all sorts of text messages. 
here we go. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh, our good friend. I'll buzz you later. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh my gosh. Whoa. What? Yo, Max, your friend Chloe texted me that you shot her down. True, Chloe. Chloe actually texted you? I sure didn't have her number. Oh, God. I don't want to embarrass you. Too late. She sounds cool. She's a cool dork. Like me? No, you're different, in a good way. So, we still down to go ape? No damn dirty human can stop me. Go ape, not human. We shall see. I hope so. Now I have to get back to reality. That sucks. Indeed. I'll buzz you later. Cool story, bro. So, Dad. Uh, what is this all? Uh, hey, honey, I just got this weird text warning me that my nosy daughter better stop watching others and look out for herself. Is this some kind of school prank? And it's from a blocked number. Oh, I'm so sorry. Some jackass in my class thought that would be funny to say. It's not. I don't like strangers having my number, okay? Me neither. Sorry. Just being a dad, I know this has been a tough week for you. It's almost over. I'll call you guys later. Love you. Max, you idiot. Tell someone. Something. Your dad is getting threats sent to his phone and you're still not telling him the truth? Or anyone? Anything? And, and, and knock knock. Hey dad. Hey. Hi. Are you an idiot? You, you get a threatening text message from someone and you're like, Hey daughter, I don't like your friends texting me with your pranks. N get a clue, idiot father. God. Everyone in this game is so, like, blind and not communicative. You okay? You okay They're all Victoria? koalas! Every single person! What's Victoria want? I thought you might be ready for the Vortex Club, but after the shit you pulled with Jefferson... Uh, oh, Jefferson. Oh, you're such an emo queen that you didn't want anybody going with him to SF. You're even too much of a pussy to enter your cliché selfies in one dumb contest. It's all about Max. Even going to the roof was about showing off, not about saving Kate. I'm going to make sure nobody at Blackwell is fooled by your woe is Max act. Get ready. All right. What's her deal, So man? I wonder if I can't go to the Vortex Club now that, uh... Just because you broke up an inappropriate relationship she was trying to start with a teacher. Jeez. Yes. Uh, Toxic Doll disagrees that everyone in the game is stupid and says that we are stupid. <laughs> Wow. Uh, Thanks, Toxic that... Doll. Uh, yes, I even killed my plant, Lisa. I'm sorry, sweetie. Get another one plant was stressful enough. Now back to the books. I want to revive my plant. Yeah, try it. How do you kill a plant in like 24 hours? Here we go. Of course, I'm still coming to visit you. You can't stop me. I miss you and my bunny. We all miss you and your bunny misses you. Yay, you're such a great friend. Thank you, Kate. Thank you for appreciating the hard work that I do. Can't wait to see you. XO Maxo. Uh, what's going on? Oh my gosh. What? Hey Justin, you busy? Max Wax, I'm busy blazing. Is that blazing in terms of like having a, a rootin' tootin' time in life or blazing as in? I believe it's 420 blazing air a day. 420 blazing air a day. Yes. So he's getting his chemical on. Do you know Frank Bowers? Drugs. That's it? Ask Nathan, he knows him, I think. Okay, I'm on it. Thanks, Justin. For what? I'm so high right now. Okay, great. Strange. Juliet. Uh. uh what? Frank, do you know Frank? You mean a van down? You mean the van down by the river? He lives in a van down by the river. Uh, I hear he's a sketchy meth head. That's about it. Why are you doing your investigation without my help? No, just bored. Talk soon. Thanks. Okay, but can't keep secrets from Ace Reporter Juliet w Watson. Hello. Okay. Great. Hey, girlfriend. Let me know when you want to come by my room, and I'll give you a fashion makeover. Oh, thanks, Courtney. I'm swamped with homework now, but I'll check in with you later. Thanks again for the offer. Max has such a busy text life. Right? Okay. Clearly understand. Go ahead through. Uh, wait. Sorry I got in your face again today and took out my bullshit rage on my best friend. Chloe, I understand. You're going through a lot. We all are. Besides, I threw your beanie out the window and busted out my rewind. Whoa! Ah, uh, okay, that is your one get out of emoji jail free card, but we still need to stock up on SIGs, coffee, and candy for an all-nighter. We gotta get into Rachel and Kate detective mode. Excellent, dear Watson. I'll bring my thinking cap. No worries, I have my beanie. I'll swing by and pick you up. Sweet, I'll be ready. And that was no emoji. Okay. Alright. Great. Cool. Um, Edward Ouch. B says we missed Aunt Dorothy earlier. Aunt Dorothy, I. Do we know anything about? Yeah, that she couldn't help because of her in health we insurance. We read the letter from her. Aunt Dorothy. 
the somehow I existed in this whole other reality. But I, I don't know what happened. The Any more thoughts? Now. There we go. Let's see. The um see how what's little that? control yeah. I have over what happens. True story. It's true, it's all about how oh, we don't have choice. Oh on maybe three different realities. How can I have a destiny? The multiverse. I wonder if Chloe would hate me for keeping her alive. But I couldn't do it. Thinking about all these lifelines almost makes my head hurt worse than the rewind. You left part of a delicious looking donut there. I see I that. Think you should polish that I was, off. I was looking at it. Looks I couldn't like get it. back on the road to Paris. There you go. Back that's there. good. Oh, that's nice. That's good. That was one thing I felt pretty badly about. It's true she story. didn't get to go. Anything out here these days? Doesn't really seem like a lot. Nothing really doing. Nope, 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 nope. Same nope. as last time. Just some dead birds. Just more, bird, more dead birds. You know how it is. It's just another bird. I thought we were supposed to look in the garage, right? I'm working on it. Holy cow. Ooh, there's House? a big... William never finished painting that wall. Oh. Oh. Oh, bummer. <laughs> Whoops. You could head down to the Home Depot, Max. Doesn't seem like you've got, you know, too busy a calendar. Uh, she is so busy. Okay. <sighs> Holy cow. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Cool. I need to, I need to. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David must be working for the Prescotts too. Ooh, we could do some Metal Gear Solid stuff oh. at Pan Estates. That'd be awesome. I promise I'll help Miss Grant next time. If there is one. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. Whoa! Miss Grant! Getting feisty! I didn't need a surveillance cam to see this suspension coming. Oh my gosh! Wow! At Whoa. least he has one weird fan. Dear Mr. Madsen, I just wanted to let you know that I think it's bullshit what happened to you and the school has too many libtard metrosexuals who don't appreciate you or the military. I felt safe in my dorm when you were in charge and I thought about you protecting me. I hope that you'll come back to Blackwell and make sure that we're all safe at night. I'm scared of this school. Wish I had surveillance Whoa. footage of that conversation. I apologize for my outburst yesterday in your office. I was upset about losing my position at Blackwell without a complete investigation of the facts and based solely on the claims of untrustworthy students. There's a cancer at Blackwell Academy and without me it will continue to spread. And that cancer's name is Nathan Prescott. As per our usual discussion about how new campus surveillance system, Ms. Grant has informed me that her petition was only one avenue of protest. While we initiate this new era of Blackwell security, we must find a middle ground between safety and privacy for our students. Wait, why is David being fired? Or on suspension? We... There's more to David Madsen than meets the eye. He should finish this. Right? We didn't do anything to no, him. No, we didn't blame him. So why, sure why why is all of a sudden he's suspended? We just broke up their marriage. We didn't get him out of a job. It could be because the principal did make the comment that that door was unlocked at the top of the uh, building, I mean, which let her out there. I and guess. That was, mm, I like, guess. that's all I could think of. That's weird. It's weird, though, that okay. like all of a sudden he's being suspended. Joyce, you know I'm not good at explaining myself or why I act the way I do sometimes. I only know that some nobody has ever understood me the way you do. I would never do anything to hurt you or Chloe. Taking care of my family is my number one mission. Yes, I overstepped bounds with the surveillance and suspension, suspicion, and I'm truly sorry and ashamed. But there are dark things happening in Arcadia Bay I've never told you. You are my wife and partner, and I know we should have no secrets. 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 I intended to tell you everything, when I, but I wanted more proof. Instead, a student almost committed suicide on my watch. You kicked me out of my favorite home, and my stepdaughter hates me. Please let Aww. me. All right. So, we're just ruining everyone's life this today. This poor guy. I kind of feel bad for him now. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. 
I wish How do you feel guilty too. about David and his inability to communicate his feelings to people? Yeah. See, that's also what happens David when you wait for proof. And well, we waited for proof, and it, it turned out well. What the hell? Did well, David no, I do mean for with Nathan? with the whole like. And what did his get more proof on Nathan David? Prescott? Get more proof on Nathan Prescott. Sometimes you run out of time it's, to get proof. You know, sometimes you have to communicate with people. Sometimes the game forces you to jump forward in time when you didn't want to jump forward in time. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David. What you hiding? What's going on in the chats? Let's see. Um, oh, look at the baby. Horse lover says, "Don't be mad at him." So don't be I mad at David. I oh, think. I want to take a um, excuse me. Oh, he's just, he's just suspended. Igna Power says because he please. he spied on Kate and Chloe. I think it's I thought it was the the spying on Kate and the leaving the door open. Uh huh. Ooh, what was the butterfly effect? Uh, so I found the blue jay nest in the... Another photo oh. from my Arcadia Bay wild In the house. Huh. But that's concerning because I let the blue jay go. Hmm. Maybe move it? Not and then bad. you can open... Sleep tight, my eggy wags. Alright, I think they'll be okay. I just hope that the blue jay, like... Comes back? Comes back. The door is always shut to the garage. Like, that blue jay would have had to go through some doors to get in anyway. It's a very creative Blue Jay, admittedly. Ooh. For once, I don't have time to search for the code. Wait. <sighs> I, I need to find a way to break this padlock. Oh, what? okay. Let's, uh, uh, do I not have time to search for the Shoot code? Shoot it what? off. What's, what's the rush here, friend? You could always rewind time to get more of it. More of what? Time. No, I have to be sparing of it. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, jeez. David is packing up wedding stuff, too. Anything? Hey, where, where are crowbar. you? Crowbar. Ooh, there it is. Okay. I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. Let's do it. Oh, use the padlock. Should I be looking for the code? Crowbar it. Sorry, David, but... I bet you would do the same thing as me. That was also really easy to crowbar off there. Max is just a pro with the crowbar. She's secretly super strong. Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. Blackwell Academy parking. She knows something. Lot what? Of, a lot of coordinates. Oh man, GPS tracking everything. Nathan beating up uh, my buddy Warren and me. No way. Way to step in there, quality guy. Right? Twilight Zone, the, the truck. Pay up, uh, me and the, okay, cool. That didn't really prove anything, I feel. Score. It proves that Nathan's Back a bully. Now. Uh, you, right, I, shows yeah. Shows him it, harassing people. It just people. showed him harassing someone. That's other good. Than, more evidence than we had on him before. I suppose. Ooh, there's a note. Looks like David already booked a room. All right. Well, if you could get rid of it so they don't talk anymore. <laughs> Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. How about we talk now about the, the heartfelt letter that he sent, that he was writing? Absolutely yeah. Have to go see Kate in the so that way right Chloe now. understands that, like, you just can't communicate. That's what I'd like to talk about. Max, you should open up. Talk about things more. It might help your friends. This is definitely Kate's fault. <sighs> the hospitals always freak me out. I, I hear you. But imagine how Kate feels. I'm so glad I, I get to see her again. I hope it's not too weird for her. No, she'll be stoked to see you. Who wouldn't be? This be it. I'm a little nervous. Just go in there this and be, be it. Is she talking about, is she talking I'm like a pirate? Apparently. I wasn't 
Cool hey, Skip. dick for blowing a fuse when you answered Kate's call. Oh man, we're seeing all our choices kind of come to fruition oh, yeah. here. I had no idea what shit she was going through. And you saved her. Like me. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Thanks, no way. Chloe. When did Chloe have Don't a change of heart? Sorry. We're all on the same team. I feel like we've jumped ahead a lot. Let Kate know we're gonna string Nathan up by his balls then. Oh yes, <laughs> I'm on it. Huh. So are we as un working okay. under the assumption that we now have enough proof? I don't know. Hey buddy. Hey! Kate looking beleaguered as usual. Beautiful as always, <laughs> Stephanie. Kate. I thought I'd never see you again. I feel so ridiculous. I'm so sorry. Kate, listen to me. You have nothing to be sorry about. Other people do. You do not know how happy I am to see you. You look awesome. Oh, what a nice lie. Wow. <laughs> what? Wow. what? That was a shade. No, no here, the I'm girls. Doing even better. Look. I'm so look, grateful to you she for coming looks up to the a roof little to talk me down. Look, she's, rough. she's grateful. Max, Thank you. I felt so lost and alone when I saw how much you cared, how hard you were trying. You made me realize I wasn't alone. Thank you, Kate. There are so many people who love you and want this to. This is a very dialogue-heavy section. I know. You should section. see all the letters and postcards. I gave most of the flowers to other patients here because they need them more than me. Oh, Kate's the best. Aww, Kate's really nice. Hot dog. One of the nurses gave me some pen and paper so I could do some drawings. I love your it's abstract. Keep practicing. It's, it's abstract. Keep That's practicing. all. For a while. But I have an she's, idea for She's an impressionist book illustrator. Oh, she's writing a children's book about I was thinking of having some photographs in there, too. I hope that's a subtle hint that you'll let me take the photographs for the book. Was that subtle? You better take the pictures, Max. Yeah! Yes. Getting to work as a photographer! Well. Employment! To visit. How are they treating you? Like they need to protect me forever. They're so upset, and I know they feel guilty even though they didn't do anything. I was surprised how many students from Blackwell wrote me. Daniel, and Mr. Jefferson, even Victoria wrote me a very sweet note. And I believe she was being real. Me too. I'm, mm. I'm working on it, Max. I just pray I can get this drawing right. Cool. Yay, she's so happy. She's doing so well. That's awesome. See, it doesn't matter if she is looking Those bad. It's that she's and feeling well. Them? Wow, props to her. All right. Cool. That's cool. Ooh, hey. Whoa. I don't think get well is quite apropos. What? What? Why not? I, I, She's in the hospital. If this gets Kate through the night, so Skip. be it. Skip. 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 <laughs> Skip. Skip. <laughs> Skip. Hey, buddy. That's <laughs> what Kate. It is so good to hang out with you again. Max, I owe you so much. And I can tell you want to talk to me about something. Ooh, shit. I skip. <laughs> skip. <laughs> Skip's like, mmm, taste the camera. Uh, oh, camera. <gasps> <laughs> uh, do we want to talk about Nathan with her? She's so happy, I don't want to like upset her at this point in time, you know? What do you think? Skip's like, it's dinner time, yo. Stephanie, focus on the game, not on Skip. He's trying to distract us from our true purpose. Do we talk to uh, Kate about Kate let's or Let's talk Nick? to Kate about Kate for now. I always want to talk to you. We missed our tea session this week. That was so not cool. We need to plan like a tea shop tour of Portland. Oh, Ooh, yes. I'll get in on that. And you could bring Stephanie Warren is all over too. that one. Warren. No, no boys allowed. No boys allowed. No boys allowed. <laughs> you are funny, Max. Skip, and seriously. Right. And right. Look at all the right choices we're making. Yes. Let's not talk about Nathan. Do you... We can... Oh, we can't rewind. Uh, Skip. Buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Do we want to talk about Nathan? I don't want to like upset her. You know? Uh, let's see. 
I would I would refer to the chat, but they're just talking about the cat. I don't blame you. Uh, let's see. <laughs> <laughs> I have to get back yeah, okay, to our, fine. our mission. Ski, don't, don't knock over the TriCaster, buddy. I do. Oh my god. That's right. Skin, that amazing. bunny. Thanks for taking care of my bunny. Tell Alice I'll see her soon. We got to need to get back to the dorm so I can take care of that bunny. I know. Holy cow. That bunny's got to be hungry, man. Right? <laughs> I love Kate's happy rainbow <gasps> flock. Jason's now wrestling with Skip. Skip, get out of here. <laughs> Bless you. Ooh. Good to see that Kate is still working. <laughs> Bless oh, you. Excuse me. Oh my gosh. Look at Kate, ever the Doing diligent homework. student. Let's hang out. Let's have a pensive moment. It's amazing to just sit here quiet with Kate again. There we go. That's nice. I don't think I'll ever know how much destiny I'm changing. True story. Because of the butterfly effect. Yeah, it's true. Whoever said we only have a single fate? Multiverse. String theory. <sighs> Time travel is such a mind fuck. Whoa. Mature string. Hella. Hella. Dank. Has the word dank ever been used as an adjective to describe anything other than weed? Like outside of like a dank basement. Like, but like, <sighs> wow, that is some dank it, stuff. See, Principal what always confuses me. Up when he wants to. Dear Kate, I just want to express my deepest wish for a speedy recovery in that Blackwell Academy is united in prayers for your return. The students and faculty have organized a rally in your honor, and I've never seen such outpouring of academic and community support for another student in our history. I know my words may mean little given your circumstances, but it's important you know that we do care. If you need assistance at all, please not hesitate. What now? That is so sweet. Even Victoria signed. <laughs> but not, not Nathan. Nathan. Victoria Chase might be queen bitch, but she's not evil. I know you hate me and you sh and you should, but I only want to see your smile again. Please let me know if you need anything. Weird. That seems out of character. Victor I mean, Victoria had that one moment where we saw, like, the real her. It's true. Here. Uh, do we want to? Okay. So two questions. Do we want to talk to her about Nathan? Thank you, sisters. You really saved Kate. That's nice. Aww. Do we want to talk to her about Nathan? That's the question. Hey, yeah, Kate, let's talk to her about Nathan. Really? Which makes me. Right. Yeah, let's do it. Okay. Here, let's talk about Victoria. I saw Ooh. Victoria's letter. How does that make you feel, Max? I know. Let me Victoria psychoanalyze you. Uh, not nice, but I do believe in forgiveness and redemption. I might be naive, but. I feel her struggle. The struggle is Me real. Too. Oh, man. I could have taken a picture of her covered in paint, but I didn't, and we had a genuine... See, all my, all my we choices all are coming full circle. It's true. Why do you think she acts so mean? She's insecure. Yeah. She's insecure. If you're comfortable with yourself, you don't need to act superior. It's true. Victoria doesn't look like she has much to be insecure about. If anybody could make Victoria see the light. It would be Kate Marsh. Oh, that's nice. Aww. Look at that. I think it will take more than that, Max. And Kate's got such a good attitude. She's so positive now. She it's reminds great. me. She reminds me of you know that phrase. Um, it's like that saying. I don't, I don't know who who the saying's by, but it's like, be nice to everyone you meet. Everyone, be nice to everyone. Everyone you meet is fighting a hard battle. It's like everyone has their own yeah. struggles, and so even if they're being really mean. Like, yeah, it's true. everybody's going through stuff. Uh -huh. It's kind of like what I talked about yesterday, too, where it's like negativity for negativity's sake is just destructive. Yeah. There's, there's no reason. No need. Nathan, it's all be nice. I want Except for Nathan. Know, he sucks. I'm this close to getting all the info I need about Nathan. Nathan Prescott has to pay for what he did. All right. And we have to stop him from That's hurting fair. anybody else. I wish I could have gotten his ass kicked out of Blackwell. Me too. Oh, getting arrested. But his dad would never let that happen. Sent to Julie. I, I had a tough family. So what is going on with him now? Prescott family? I get, yeah, I would go Prescott family. I think his family is totally protecting him. Or worse. I never say this about people. But Max, there's something evil about the Prescotts. Oh. They have something to do with death. We're going to death? stop. What? Him. What? 
I just have to find Nathan's room number. That was a... Get inside and get the clues I need. Max, please let me help. I can get the number and I'll text it to you. Okay? Oh, well, there you so go. Of course. Yeah. Can. Yeah. I can't do this without you. Hey, now it's good we talked to her about him. Right? For us. I have to get back to our uh, mission. You don't know how much it means to see you again. I do. That's why I love you, Max. Oh, thanks for taking care of the bunny. Gotta take care of the bunny. Yeah, don't let that bunny die. Don't let the bunny die. Let's not. Let's not. That would be truly. I'm a little concerned about that bunny. I am also concerned about the bunny. It is very alarming that there is an expectation that I'm caring for that bunny. We killed that plant in like record time. Thank God. I overwatered. I tried. Thanks for coming with me. Now let's go pay a visit to Nathan Prescott. Oh man. Okay. That little prick is not gonna be glad when he sees us. Oh, I'm gonna take him down. Yeah. Taking him down. Oh, and look who it is. The teacher that mm. loves me. Because I got him suspended. Whoops. Not my fault, really. Here's a question. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna throw it out to you and Jason. We're at two hours I know, right I was, now. I was gonna Is wrap this the point up, where actually. we should break? Because I don't know. I was like, waiting for this cut. See, if, if there's a big same, long stretch. We're on the same wavelength. I was just waiting for this cut scene to end. Okay, cool, That's great, right. awesome. That weirdo totem. I won't forget that totem. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. Hey, look how friendly he's I'm being. Okay. Um. And this I is don't know. I think he's a. Yeah. You know, I think he's got an Chloe, agenda. Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for the school. It's a what? Long story. In actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything. Did, did you forget that I got I you suspended, sir? Wait, what? Sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note. Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going Is to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You what? can't force an artist to work. So you don't hate me for what I oh. said to the principal? I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just Get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely. Everything is so touchy feely. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. And nobody should have Whoa. to see me dance. Plus, how forward of you, watch the there, Chloe? Trying to keep up with the kids. I have some. Problem. Being anti-establishment, she's like, yeah, teach, well. dance with me. She. That is a bit anti-establishment. Look at it. She's like. You are out of like follow, oh, giving yeah. him the eyes. Oh yeah, the the they will look up Shut and down. Up. Holy cow! Just because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring. <laughs> Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. Okay. I'm confused about Mr. Jefferson. I'm a bit confused about everything that's Nathan going is. on, actually. All right, so here, let's... Okay, all right, the, all right. To your point, it's been two hours. I think this is a good place to kind of, like, pause before we get into kind of, like, what I'm assuming is a, the party or, like, the, like, Nathan Prescott investigation. Yeah. Get, get my rager on. Get my rave on. Uh, 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 uh. Ice cream scoop. Ice cream scoop. Ice cream scoop. Ice cream scoop. Lawn yeah. mower. Lawn mower. Yeah? So... Yeah, this is interesting. Do you ever do the shopping cart? All the time did I ever do the shopping. I invented the shopping cart. No, Stephanie. you didn't, because I was doing that sucker in middle school. Here, let's do the shopping Why cart. Bad. Okay, ready? Just to prep for next time. Ready? Do, 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 we're just, uh, we're gearing up for the rave. Jason has Jason fa is face asleep. palmed over there. Jason, did Hardcore. you set Deadpool live? Hey, hey so there, you go. there we go. Now that the live stream is done, you should hop on over to Film Theorists and uh, check out our Deadpool episode, all about uh, how to kill Deadpool. Exciting. It's exciting. So uh, anyway, we're going to wrap things up here today because we've been going for a while. It feels like a pretty good place to kind of like pause things. We didn't kill Chloe. Once again, we've saved her life. Ish. Uh, I'm 
interested to see how this new timeline yeah. plays into things and how our decisions are starting to... Like, it's good to see Katie be happy about the decision to, like, save her and how yeah, we were able to help her. Yeah, that was clearly the right choice. I'm curious how all this other stuff starts to play out, though. It'll be interesting. Chloe, um, Chloe's started to make a little progress, though, I feel. She's strangely she's, positive now. She's a little bit more positive. She's getting some perspective on her own actions. She's like, hey, I sucked before. Sorry about that. So we'll see. Hopefully it's changing for the good. Knock right? on wood. And that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. And remember, that's just a stream. A live stream. Go watch Deadpool. Film theory. Go watch the Deadpool stream. Not, it's not a stream. It's the a dead, theory. The, it's a, the... Also, I did Trump theory too the, the day before. So watch two film theories. Oh my back gosh, back. so much film, so, so much, much film, film theory. All so right, so much theory. Uh, Jordan Rodriguez, goodbye. Ethan went. Meme Lord, dank memes. XX girl X gamer XX. That Bye. Is not just dank weed, but dank memes. Yeah, totally true. Uh, Alex Flores, bye. Mystic Pencil, you guys are my dank buds. Oh, that's so sweet. Well, stay dank. Stay dank, friends. Uh, <laughs> Anna crying, bye.